in the world. Ten rounds in the heavyweight division. And now the time has come. All the talk, now comes the walk. His adversary. Protect yourselves at all times. Let's touch them up. Little get to know you here in the opening round, scheduled for 10. Double jab by Crusher. He takes a shot and then commits to giving one right back. There's the uppercut, one of my favorite punches, and it works that time for him. Rush is showing you what it takes to be the best in this business. Good, crisp combos. Both fighters told us that they want to have a similar approach early on here. They want to show a lot of varied attacks. Well, that gives them a better opportunity to be effective throughout the night. Worked out really well, throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. Punches and bunches, working well. Russia's right hand working well that time, he scored well. Good work defensively by Crusher. Plus, he landed that counter punch. Yeah, and he forced him to punch. He made him, he drew it out of him, and then he timed him beautifully. That right hand serving him well. Lands a big hook. Targeting that head with the combination punching. Oh, he took some damage, but he gave some back with the right hand. Step to the side and then lands the counter. Yeah, disappear on him, and then all of a sudden appear on him. Well, you could see what he wanted to do there, but unable to land that body shot. Final 10 seconds. Blocks the headshot. It's tough to assess, but Crusher's cut may look. Here we go. Round two is underway. Downstairs with a right hand. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. A little something for his opponent after getting tagged. He just missed that shot up top. Takes one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Targeting that jab with the right hand behind it. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. And now he's targeting upstairs. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. Teddy, is it raw skill? Is it technique? What's the answer for him? Why is he missing so many punches and tiring himself out here? It's forgetting about the idea. The idea that it's not enough just to throw a punch. You have to have a plan to land it. You know, you have to have a missile to get it to the target. Otherwise, what does it do? Just blows up, makes a hole in the ground, and when it rains, guess what? You go swimming. He's going to go swimming later. Really good work right there, landing the two punches in sequence by Crusher. This is why the fans love this game when it's at its absolute best. This round can't get any better, yet they're trying to make it better. It's wearing us out. Imagine what they feel like. Crusher showing you a little defensive skill there. And they'll move away from that punch. Comes right back at him with a left hand. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Good fundamental work landing the one-two there. And that's the end of round two. And round number three is underway. There's another left hand from him. He 
got hit, but he sends it right back. Well-timed, well-placed uppercut there. Missed the target with that hook. And yet another right hand lands. Keeping his hands up, getting way of his opponent's efforts. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Oh, a nice two-punch combo by Crusher. Place left hand up top. Crashes home with the uppercut. Able to land with the right. Lands flush with the two punch combo by Crusher. Good effective work with that straight right hand. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. He returns the favor with a right hand of his own. Teddy, he did a smart thing right there. Just created enough space and then landed the counterpunch. Looked like the will of the wish, the old great Willie Pep. Made him miss, made him pay. Big uppercut right on the mark. And now committing to that midsection as the target with the combination punch. Turns over that hook, and he does damage upstairs. And the bell rings. Signif round number four. Teddy, the way your scorecard reads, he's up three rounds to zip. Good, accurate punching, earning him that lead. Yeah, very conservative. Hasn't wasted anything. But, as you just touched on, has made everything count. Unable to lay on the receipt. And bang, and away he goes. Targeting that head and landing Two, with a bomb. Three. Four, Come on! Five, get on your feet! Six. So he goes down for the first time, but you can just get a sense that he's going to be okay. Doesn't look like he's that damaged. Big shot there. Oh, he doesn't look good. He just went down, and not the way he wanted it to go. No, he's standing on the outside, Joe. He shouldn't be standing there. The old timers would say, take a walk around the block. And somehow, some way, he's going to continue on here. And if he's going to stay in this fight, now he's got to avoid his opponent like the black flag. He saw the uppercut. He took advantage, throwing it out there. Little head knocking with that right hand. Scored well up top. Up top with the quick hook. Oh, he just misses with that head shot. Teddy, we know what the problem is. He's getting hit by left hands. Offer up the solution. Well, Joe, there's three lines of defense. Either you're blocking punches, you're moving your head, or you're using a... And yet another big shot comes in. Can he beat the count? I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got that saying. Falling like a sack of potatoes. Five. Six. He gets up after that punch. Put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy. You gotta love the offense there, putting his punches together. That's just good, solid, accurate work by Crusher. Crusher's defense, solid. That was a big shot that floored him, and it's a big One, shot that may end him right two, here. That looked like the great three, pitch of great Maddox. Four, His sinker ball. Boy, five, it went down quick. Six, seven, eight. There's just no quit in this guy. He's been damaged, but still he's trying to make a fight of it. Look, I love that about him. The fans love that about him. It's great. But go. he's got to yeah. learn time to clinch a little bit, survive a little. He has a new round in front of him, but I don't know that there's any new hope. He's been down numerous times tonight, including that last round. You never know what a person's capable of when they're pushed to the brink. But this would be very unlikely. It would be spectacular. Good, strong combo. 
offense. Well, his opponent is opening up and coming forward, so I would think there are some opportunities that exist. Yeah, I think some counter-punching opportunities. Opportunities not on the front end, but on the back end. Russia's almost looking foolish that time he missed so badly. Comes right back with some offense of his own. He is not in good... Oh, and there you go. Wow, he goes down again. This is going to be called the elevator fight. Up and down all night. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's over. This fight is over. Crushers, bombs away, worked again. Knockout victory for him. By way of knockout. That's what you want to see, a guy who can close the show and finish with style. He ends